Hi everybody, Pastor Dennis here again, and let me just tell you how thrilled I am that you've stayed involved and you're enjoying God's small group. Uh, I just love the fact that we're connecting together the way the scriptures tell us that we really should. This last weekend, I covered one of my favorite topics in all the scriptures, that of connecting together in mentoring relationships. Uh, if you're able to be with us, you'll remember the passage, Luke chapter, chapter 6 and verse 40. Uh, it simply says that a, a student or pupil, when he is fully trained, will be like his teacher. In other words, as we emphasized, we turn out like the people who disciple us, who train us, who mentor us. Those who input in our lives effectively shape us into the people that we're going to be. I thought a lot about that principle this week because I think I may have mentioned to you before that I'm actually turning 60 years old in just a couple of months. I know that's quite hard to believe. But uh, at 60, I realized I'm very much a conglomeration of a whole number of different people who have impacted me as a person. Obviously started with my family of origin, with my folks, especially my dad. His influence on my life was uh, just uh, goes beyond words that can say. I look in the mirror in many ways, I've turned out to be just like my dad. But then the other people who began to input into my life, my older sister, very, very impactful in the spiritual dimension of my life. She was the first who came to faith in Christ in our family. Through her godly witness, through her love and her care and concern for me, began to see what it meant to live like Jesus. She'd been a great influence. After that, there were so many others, names that some might recognize, Bob Craning from Forest Home, Dave Hopkins, great influence on, on me spiritually, encouraged me in the Word of God. Uh, one of our former pastors here at Emmanuel Faith, Jim Adkins, really encouraged me in the memorization of Scripture. Much of who I am as a pastor was shaped by Jim and that influence. And the list just goes on and on, especially when I came to Emmanuel Faith so many, many years ago. Uh, Jim Welch, so influential, and then especially uh, Dr. Strauss and the way that he taught, the way that he lived. Well, it's, I've had so many mentors in my life. A student, when he is fully trained, will be like his teacher. Now, and so during your small group together, I, I think it would be good for you to start off with the question, who have been some of the people who have influenced you? Uh, what did they do? How did they live? What principles did they teach you? Share that among yourselves, and it would be really good as we connect together. We learn how, how God is working in our lives through other people. And then to have you stop and, and uh, talk a little bit about how you can intentionally mentor others, how you can pass along the things that you have learned to help other people on their journey. So I hope that you enjoy your time together. This is really a fun topic as we look to see how God is using us, especially in connecting together for the purpose of enjoying God's people. So may the Lord bless you. I hope you have a great time.